swollen. <laughs> hey guys, good morning. So today is Friday and we are out here now at the mall. We as in my sister and I. So we are now at my town because we are going for a room 8008 opening. Am I speaking very softly? I don't know. But yeah, we are going to grab a quick lunch at Family Mart because I don't have any cash. We wanted to eat porridge but they only accept cash. She's having the cheesy honey. Hmm? Okay. And I'm just having this. Japanese soba. Uh, I'm not really that hungry because it's still pretty early. It's like before 12 and I had my breakfast really late but I know that I won't have time to eat later. I'm not sure whether can you hear me but I woke up this morning with a poorly left eye. I couldn't open my eyes. It was really painful and it just kept tearing but like even till now it's still like tearing this happened to me pretty often I think especially when the day before I spent too many hours facing the laptop because I was actually at Starbucks yesterday with my friend if you saw the last vlog yeah we were there for almost five to six hours and I was just facing the laptop and I slept pretty late I kind of know why why this is happening and yeah it just so happens that it's today and I wasn't gonna go to the event because <laughs> I couldn't open my eyes so I'm just wearing my glasses uh -huh. ah. my face looks so red I just had the wasabi and it hit me through the nose oh my gosh I feel like this side of my face from my eyes to my nose it's just I don't know it's numb <laughs> Oh my god, I feel like getting an ice cream. <coughs> hey guys, so it's now 12 pm. My left eye is not as painful. I was just here yesterday for like half the day, and now I'm here again. Oh, I just walked past Auntie Anne, and I really, really feel like getting the seaweed one because I haven't had Auntie Anne in such a long time. Oh, when I look at the, 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 the pretzel, I was just salivating. Anyway, we're now heading to room 8008 for the grand opening. And later, my, my sister and I are actually planning to go to Pavilion. So yeah, we're gonna go to Pavilion because I need to go to Michael Kors to get some of this buttons I need to get additional buttons because it's like really long so yeah it's not cute so I need to get extra holes and I'm not sure whether do they do that but I'm just gonna try my luck and I'm also looking for fragrances I listened to a podcast this morning talking all about fragrances I just feel like I need a good fragrance like a scent for myself also whenever my eye is like having this problem right I think the only thing is that it's really not the only thing I mean it's really sensitive to lights especially it's like really really sensitive so whenever I look at really bright stuff it's like it starts to tear <laughs> and I just can't open my eyes came to the shop and there's no one here at all <laughs> So I went up to the girl and I asked whether is it today and she was like, isn't it tomorrow? And I was like, uh, tomorrow? And then she checked and she said that they are only starting at 1. So, okay, it's today and that's good. I have a hair in my eyes. Oh my god, look at my eyes. Oh my god, look. We are now gonna go get some ice cream at Ikea. I've been meaning to try their soy ice cream, soya ice cream. So excited! Also, I've never tried Ikea's snacks before and I'm not sure whether are they good so if you have ever tried it let me know hey this is the best part oh oh, oh. yes okay I have not tried the yeah, soya ice cream before so let's try I think I should take a picture first. I just realized that, I mean not that I just realized, but I've always known that my side here is a bit bald. <laughs> like I don't have much hair going on over here, but let's try. Mm. I don't remember 
their normal vanilla one so I can't compare has it always been soya flavor? I don't think so right? let me know if you know because I would really love to know I don't think it tasted like this back then just found out that they have samples here so I'm gonna try the oats biscuit I'm not sure whether it's this one but I have a feeling that it's this one I think it must have onion already. It's soft. <laughs> As some of you may know, I don't really shop at H&M. First off, their style don't really match me and it's fast fashion. But I recently realized that they have... I mean, I noticed that they have this H&M conscious thing where most of it are recycled fibers and also made from organic cotton, which is obviously much better so I've started coming to H&M again I found this pants that I really love look at it well and I just took a white shirt because I I wear white shirt most of the time so I just want to see how it looks and it looks so good oh my god I love it I'm also thinking of sizing up oh my eyes is acting weird again it's starting to close I just want to feel really comfortable and not too tight here so I think I'm gonna size up Yeah, I just want to feel comfortable and confident again with things that I like <laughs> I really love this compared to the other two dress This is my favourite Oh my god I love it. I'm just waiting for her to get back to me with a bigger size because this is S. Event is done. See that not I think it's like 2 30. The girls said room 8008 is so lovely. One of the girls there, Wendy, she watches my video, which I'm like, oh my god. But never people tell me that they watch my video. I don't know, it's just so nice to know. But yeah, I've got some goodies here. I am gonna go to HM and get the pants and the shirt because I didn't have time to buy it just now I was already late for the event so yeah before we go pavilion I'm just gonna quickly grab it first because I really love it let's go I'm already here <laughs> hey guys so I just we made it to um, pavilion we were actually here for quite some time already I went to the Michael Kors shop but they can't get more hooks <laughs> for my back strap because their puncher thing is not working so yeah I need to come another day which is so annoying but after that I went to a few shop too okay all my battery yeah all my camera batteries are not charged so it's gonna run out anytime now but I'm gonna quickly say what I'm gonna say yeah we went to Diptyque Jo Malone and now we are at Takiyuki we're gonna get some shaved ice ice things and just press cross my leg really really hurts so yeah I'm gonna switch to my phone after this it's blinking so this is my first time trying the kaki gori but they've now changed the name to kaki yuki kaki yuki so yeah this is the hojicha one I look so tired oh I also Hey guys, so it is currently 6.40 p.m. Just showered, washed my hair uh -huh. and dinner is ready. I'm about to go and have our dinner now. I'm just waiting for the Sabrina Wong and... Oh, how you wait for me? But before that, I thought I would show you what I picked up at room 8008 because they're really kind enough to let me pick one stuff, so... Yeah, I had a really hard time deciding what to get because it's been a while since the last time I wore a dress, florally prints because as you can tell from my Instagram, I've just been wearing really plain but comfortable to me kind of clothes. So yeah, I am suddenly not used to seeing floral prints on me and I just wasn't attracted to any of the floral prints dress even though some of them were really really pretty. Sorry. I had to go for a much more muted and plain dress which I absolutely love So it's on the floor Wait, let me just show you, huh? Okay And Oh, I actually showed you in the vlog itself So yeah, I picked up this dress in the size S because they ran out of size M The best part is that it has pockets 
and the material is also really thick it's like a really well structured dress which I really really love and I left my belt at the shop so I might need to go back there and pick it up so it's only the three of us having dinner so I made which is rice, fabulous. broccoli baked Thanks. beans cause you can just steam everything and miso soup this is like organic white miso soup so today is Monday I didn't vlog during the weekend because on Saturday I just spent almost the whole day editing the vlog that went up on Saturday it took me so long to edit that vlog on Sunday I just did some assignments and also some bin and beam stuff which I totally forgotten oh. that by the time you're watching this right you already know about the whole bin and beam stuff so yeah I'm doing that and yeah today is Monday and I thought I would just get up from the house because I feel more productive when I do like when I'm around people, like in cafes and stuff. So I'm gonna do that. And yeah, not sure which mall or cafe to go to yet. I will figure that out. I'm about to leave, but I thought I would just pack like a little snack box because I think and I'm sure I will be hungry during the day because you know, when you spend so much time using your brain, your brain needs food. So I'm gonna go and pack my lunch uh, snack box, which I can now show you whenever I pack my lunch box and snack box. I know I haven't shown you much of what I bring to uni for the past few months because I've been using that lunchbox so yeah, I can now show you okay, sorry for the mess it looks like a shop my dad says that this is like a shop I need another cabinet <laughs> it's so full but it's mainly like organic superfood stuff which if you want a code, I have a code for you mm -hmm. a lot of you said that you have been searching for superfoods brand like local one and you didn't know that we have one so now you know you can use my code for 10% off I just had my cacao powder drink with maca powder to give me some energy mm -hmm. oh I painted my nails I don't really like it but whatever so I've been using this since July yeah it's crazy it's already October I've been using it trying it just to make sure that it's okay it doesn't leak and yeah it really doesn't leak so you don't have to worry and yeah I've been using it since July so I'm gonna pack my snack in here okay so this is my little snack box for the day i've got some jacob's crackers cashew and almonds what i really love about this is that it's really really compact but it fits so much now i know that there are some that are like foldable silicon one and i i don't know why but i just don't like that i don't like the feeling of having my food in a silicony material kind of thing it feels really weird i still want a like actual box it just feels more real and even though it does takes up a little bit more space compared to like silicon foldable ones right i really do still prefer the whole experience and the feeling of holding an actual hard lunch box you know what i mean yeah i don't know why i just i'm never drawn to like those foldable ones even though it's like you know foldable but i'm just like uh no. So yeah, that is why I don't get those foldable cup. I will get an actual cup even though it doesn't fold. I want like an actual feeling and not like soft. Ooh, it's just so cute. Hey guys, update. It is currently 11.37 a.m. I've been here for almost more than, slightly more than an hour. Sorry that it's so echoey but it's pretty echoey in here. Just did my warm up. Eh, just did my workout, cool down, and now I'm just gonna practice a little bit for my class. Which, okay, so I've been to my class now for, I've been there twice. Now I'm just not sure whether do I want to continue because of the amount of effort it requires. And I'm not sure whether can I juggle so many things, but I really, really... I'm passionate about it and I really want to, you know, at least achieve something in this. So I think I'm gonna continue and power on even though my leg really hurts and it's not ideal for me to join. After I've decided whether to attend for the second month, whether I decide to continue or not, I will let you know again and then I'll let you know what class is it. <laughs> I don't think you expect it but yeah I'm gonna go shower get ready in a bit and head to the mall so yeah that is the plan I really love the weather today it's like so gloomy and just gloomy <laughs> all right hey guys so you can't see me but it is currently almost 6pm and I've been here 
<laughs> yeah, I've been here doing some bin and bin stuff, working really hard. And I just only finished eating my snack box. I just didn't have time. I was just really into doing my stuff. <laughs> So yeah, I think my family will be coming in a bit, I'm not sure. Ah! <laughs> Ooh, the sunlight. Okay, that is too harsh. So today is the next day. Yeah, I didn't vlog much yesterday because as you know, I was at Starbucks, no, I was at Coffee Bean for almost 6 hours, 5 to 6 hours just doing my stuff I don't like my hair that way, I will regret it Yeah, I was just there getting stuff done for Bean and Beam The video is going up tonight and I just want to get some things ready Today is gonna be the same, I'm gonna go to the gym and then I'm gonna find another coffee place, maybe J and Co or Juan Valdez or whatever yeah, I'm gonna find another place because Starbucks is great but it can get a bit too noisy because since it's like, you know, Starbucks so I wanna find a much more quiet one even though I love like the whole surrounding by people kind of thing the noise just gets a bit too much so I just wanna go for a much more chill coffee shop and I won't be getting coffee anymore because I ordered my cold brew around 1pm yesterday and around 4pm or 3pm I was still having a few sips because obviously it was next to me and it's just like this natural reaction to just grab and drink and it's cold brew so the caffeine in it is so strong and I couldn't sleep last night and I didn't enjoy that <laughs> so I'm gonna skip the coffee but I might actually just get like cakes or pastries so we'll see how it goes I might get one of those actually um, what day is today? today is Tuesday still a holiday, no class yahoo and I am about to make my breakfast I actually stopped going for badminton on Tuesday night cause if you know I go on every Tuesday night not sure whether you know that but yeah I go on every Tuesday night but now since I have my class on Wednesday I don't think that's possible anymore because after every badminton session right my body will hurt my legs will hurt and I won't be able to go for my class in my best state possible oh also if you're not familiar with how pre-order works right for the 365 box if you haven't watched my last video then you wouldn't know what I'm talking about basically pre-order means you can now order make your payment first just like how you would when you buy something online and then your order will be shipped in the second week of November so it's like pre-order you know during this pre-order period you can enjoy free shipping within Peninsula Malaysia so if you want to enjoy free so if you want to enjoy free shipping just go and pre-order now so if you need a lunch box you might as well invest in one that is durable that you can use over and over again I was also just updating bin and bims I'm sorry if I keep talking about it but since these are also new on this channel I just want to give as much information possible basically right now I'm just telling like a friend like how I would with we not I'll be like oh my god we not and it's the same with you guys it feels so great so yeah I should stop talking now and make my breakfast we do not have any more braids so I'm gonna make smoothie why do I keep stretching my hands up I don't know but yeah let's go and make smoothie hey guys so today didn't go according to my plan let me just fill you in it's pretty sad I mean to me at least I went to the gym when I was about to finish my session I felt so terrible and sick inside like I really wanted to vomit and I just feel so stuffed so what I think happened was that I had way too much for breakfast like the smoothie that I made was so so filling but I didn't notice cause I felt okay like I didn't feel full so yeah, I really felt like vomiting but I still went and did my skincare managed to fill in my brows <laughs> and then I was really contemplating whether should I just go back home cause I really don't feel like going anywhere and my oh my god my table is so messy <laughs> And my bags were so 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 heavy. I brought this 
whole tub of water out because I thought I'm gonna be there till evening and it's not light. Let me just tell you, it's not light. So yeah, I carried all that and it just didn't make me feel any better like with all the heavy bags. It just felt way worse and I really felt like vomiting. I was just praying that I don't vomit in the train or in the grab car back home. I was so scared. It just reminds me of the day I got back from Penang recently. Anyway, I came home around 11.43, like before noon, and then I went and sleep. Cause I also didn't have much sleep last night. So I went and sleep, woke up one and a half hour later, and now it's, I'm awake. I've been meaning to clear up my desk a little bit, but it just didn't happen. Let me just put you somewhere. Ouch. Hello? Is it focused? Okay. It's just days like today where I feel uh, like it just makes me scared to go out the next time because I just wasted so many hours. Oh, also, when I went out with CD on Sunday, I actually went to Innisfree. I really wanted to um, get a serum because I just found out that serum is a thing. <laughs> Every day is a learning day guys. Every day I learn something new. So yeah, serum is apparently a thing. Innisfree has serum and it's actually their number one bestseller. So I went there, I actually bought this. The nail polish. My nails are so, so weak. Really, really weak. I think it's ever since I got the gel nail manicure last year for the Samsung campaign. Ever since then, my nails has been like super duper week this is the longest that it has this is the longest that it has ever been look like this one didn't make it so it already broke not sure whether does it work um but i still went and got it anyway and then i just really want to get back into the whole manicure thing again because not manicure i mean like nail polish thing because it just makes me feel much more put together much more ladylike which i love i bought this i don't hate it but i also don't love it you know, but I don't mind. I was talking about the serum, right? <laughs> so I also went and got a few samples. They gave me three. If you ever want to buy a skincare products, right, but you're not sure, you can always ask for sample. They, they are more than happy to give you sample. So don't be scared, just ask for the sample. I've really used two. The situation with my skin now is that it's starting to break out again. Not sure whether can you tell, look. And also my forehead look. So it's either the Clarins UV sunscreen. I think it's that. I'm now putting a hole first on that and see my skin condition. My skin was starting to react again. Like it was really red. When your skin is reddish means that it's dehydrated. But now it's like better. Mm -hmm. After two use of this. Might actually just get the whole tub. Lah. I am gonna go and set up my laptop. Oh so tired oh my god it's almost november every time towards the end of october right i'll be like oh my god to be honest even though this whole year i am 20 years old but i don't think i'm 20 years old <laughs> it only counts after my birthday on my birthday because now i'm still 19 i don't care what you say i don't care what everyone else say they always tell me like no you're already 20 i'm like no actually it is true right i am still 19 i haven't even reached my 20 yet oh my god i'm gonna be 20 can you imagine it oh my god oh i also need to start like hanging back the pictures up here or i might actually get something else to hang those pictures because it just keeps falling so i get so frustrated every time that is why it's now somewhere in there i don't sit in here anymore because i feel so clustered and like ugh, when i'm in here i feel like this is not closed properly and it's gonna fall so wish me luck we actually have two diffusers this one is a bigger one and we don't really use this often because it's really ma fun to change the water and to put essential oil and this one is more of like an air purifier thing but you can use like you can add like essential oils and this one it's like a muji diffuser knockoff because muji ones are like 300 ringgit for this but we got this from i think either shopee like my mom bought this this is my favorite it's the doTERRA lit sea scent it's like lemongrass tropical not tropical it's like spa so I normally add three drops four okay sometimes four you can like mix in different types of essential oils so I have 
um, three here. This one is the Rose Blend. This is from Sensatia Botanicals. And I'm also gonna add this Eucalyptus Leaf. And then once you've added all your essential oil, you just Set it. Mm -hmm. You can either set it for an hour, two hours, or three hours. I normally put it for three hours. And there's also like light. Ooh. It is now 2.41 p.m. I am starting to feel a bit hungry. The reason why I've not eaten is because I don't want to over force feed myself even though I'm not forcing. So yeah, I might actually eat some biscuits now. Yeah, <laughs> just thought I would tell you that. I don't know. <laughs> for the past hour, I just have been doing some bean and dim stuff uh -huh. and it's already 6 p.m. so I am cooking dinner let me just show you I'm just stir frying some onions I can't wait to shower <laughs> I am also gonna cook like a French bean stir fry with this but you can't see with this chili garlic sauce that I bought yesterday no on Sunday okay my fried egg is done I really do need to learn how to flip perfectly so now that's left to do is to stir fry the french beans and oh by the way i actually found this at jaya grocer the one at mid valley no gardens also just gonna put this tofu into the steamer ah the cloth all right okay pop that back i'm just gonna mince some garlic first oh it's so cute so <laughs> I am now eating this and I also just uploaded that bean and beam video which I'm so nervous I've never been this nervous before I'm not sure how would the response be you know hey guys so it is now almost 12 a.m definitely way past my bedtime so I think I would I mean I think I should just go to bed now and end the vlog here so yeah thank you so much for watching I really need to start editing this vlog <laughs> all right I'm gonna sleep now bye Mm-hmm.